Hello Displorers, welcome back to another informative video presented by Displore. As you all know, it's always a pleasure presenting to you some interesting but lesser known facts about the beautiful countries on the African continent. Today we're excited to present to you some lesser known facts about the beautiful country of Uganda. Officially referred to as the Republic of Uganda, Uganda is a landlocked country located in the east central part of Africa. It is bordered to the east by Kenya, to the north by South Sudan, to the west by the Democratic Republic of Congo, to the southwest by Rwanda, and to the south by Tanzania. Uganda is relatively small compared to Kenya, Ethiopia, and Tanzania. It ranks 33rd in terms of area in Africa and 10th in population. As of 2019, the population was estimated at 44 million, 6 million less than Kenya, which is twice as large in size. Uganda is a country rich in history and full of large natural beauty from border to border. However, it often falls under travelers' radar due to past political conflicts and the relative difficulty of getting there. But that doesn't mean there's not plenty to discover about this East African country. If you're new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. The capital city of Uganda is Kampala, and English and Swahili are the capital languages of the country. With that said, let's take a closer look at this country with the 10 things you probably didn't know about Uganda. Number 1. Uganda is the most entrepreneurial country in the world. Shocking, right? I bet if you were asked which countries in the world were the most entrepreneurial, you would probably say China, the United States, or even Great Britain. Well, sorry to disappoint you, the most entrepreneurial country in the world is actually Uganda. Uganda, whose economy was devastated by dictatorship a few decades ago, now has the planet's highest proportion of people who've started their own businesses. 28% of the adult population in Uganda started businesses in the last 42 months, which is actually twice as high as any other country in the world. Thailand comes in 2nd place with 16.7% and Brazil in 3rd place with 13.8%. Uganda's success, the report claims, is the result of a huge improvement in communication networks recently which have linked up different parts of the country and connected it to the rest of the world. In general, developing nations came highest on the list of 73 countries. Of all the developed countries, Australia ranked highest in 29th place, followed by Canada in 30th place. Number 2. Uganda has the second youngest population in the world. According to the latest World Population Review, Uganda has the second youngest population in the world right after Niger with 55% of its population below the age of 15, with a life expectancy of 58 years. According to reports, about 2 million babies are born in Uganda every year. The young population is also accredited to high fertility rates seen as of 2017. The average female gives birth to 6 children. Also, early marriages and lack of family planning is also responsible for the birth rate in the country. Uganda is one of the poorest countries in the world due to high dependency rate on the population given the fact that it consists mainly of minors who cannot fend for themselves. Although the Ugandan government is trying to reduce birth rate in the country, their efforts seem abortive. Number 3. Uganda is the second most populated landlocked country in the world. As earlier mentioned, Uganda is a landlocked country located in the central eastern part of Africa and has a surface area of about 241,083 km square, making it the 33rd largest country in Africa and the 79th in the world. In terms of population, the country has over 44 million, making it the second most populated landlocked country in the world after Ethiopia. Number 4. Yuweri Museveni has been president of Uganda for more than three decades. Uganda has been led by President Yuweri Museveni for the past 33 years, and from the look of things, he is unlikely to step down anytime soon. Museveni rose to power in 1986 after overthrowing Tito Okello in a military coup. Since then, Uganda has remained politically stable except for the Lord Resistant Army that operates in the jungle of Uganda and the Democratic Republic of Congo. For the same period, the United States has had six presidents. Museveni rules Uganda with an iron fist and crushes anyone who opposes his regime, though he's not considered a dictator. Number 5. Uganda is home to the world's second freshwater lake. Lake Victoria is one of the African Great Lakes. 
The lake was renamed Lake Victoria after Queen Victoria by the explorer John Hannings Perker in his report, The First Briton to Document It. With a surface area of approximately 59,947 square kilometers, Lake Victoria is Africa's largest lake by area, the world's largest tropical lake, and the world's second largest freshwater lake by surface area, after Lake Superior in North America. The lake serves as habitat to several species of fish, reptile, and mammals. Number 6. Uganda has a history of coups. Uganda is generally politically stable under the rule of Yoweri Museveni, but that has not always been the case. As soon as the country became independent, rulers and military began competing for power. Milton Obote overthrew Edward Mutesa in April 1966, setting off a series of coups that toppled more than five presidents. Youssef Lule deposed Idi Amin in April 1979, only to be overthrown 68 days later. Paolo Mwanga overthrew Godfrey Binaisa in May 1980, but resigned 10 days later due to fear of being deposed. General Basilio Olara Okello served two days before he was replaced by General Tito Okello. Though Museveni has tried to stabilize the country, he is still largely criticized for changing the constitution so that he can be president for life. Number 7. Uganda is one of the few countries in Africa that designed its own car. For many years, Africa has been consumer of many manufactured goods but never a producer. When it comes to cars, many African nations have settled for relying on imports rather than manufacturing their own. However, a few African nations have gone against the odds and built their own cars. Some of these countries include Ghana, Rwanda, Kenya and Uganda. Kira Motors Operation is a car manufacturing company in Uganda that manufactures cars such as the Kira F Smart Cars. The Kira F-Smart is an electric hybrid 5-seater front-wheel drive sedan car. Kira Motors Corporation was started by university students but has since gained funding and support from the government of Uganda. The Kira F-Smart features a traction motor powered by a rechargeable battery bank and an internal combustion engine-based generator. It's a fully grown model of the initial Kira Eve prototype. It is the first electric hybrid vehicle designed and built in Africa. Number 8. Fried Grasshopper Eye, popular Ugandan delicacy. Pan fried grasshopper, locally known as Senene, are a popular delicacy in Uganda and serve to important guests as a show of good gesture. If a Ugandan household offers you this delicacy, then you're a special guest, and rejecting it is considered disrespectful. Grasshopper are a rich source of protein and are consumed abundantly during the rainy season when their numbers swell. Besides grasshopper, Ugandans also have a wide variety of food, such as matuke, amongst others. So if grasshopper isn't really your thing, be rest assured, you won't die of starvation in Uganda. Number 9. Social media tax is compulsory in Uganda. Social media has become a part of our lives. We are constantly posting our pictures on Facebook and Instagram and instantly communicating with our loved ones. But in Uganda, social media is not free. For you to have access to social media, you need to pay what is called social media tax. The institution of fee was first proposed in March 2018 by President Yoweri Museveni in a bid to curb gossip and increase revenue. Then in July, the East African nation introduced a tax on users accessing 60 websites and social media apps from their phone, including WhatsApp, Twitter and Facebook. The levy is collected by telecom companies who deduct a daily or weekly fee whenever a user accesses the specified apps. Authorities also increased excise duty fee on mobile money transactions from 10% to 15%. The introduction of social media tax has greatly reduced the number of internet users in the country. There's been a petition to abolish the tax, but the petition is still in review by the Ugandan government. Number 10. Uganda was the venue of the daring Entebbe raid. On June 27, 1976, Palestinian and German terrorists hijacked an Air France plane flying from Tel Aviv to Paris. The aircraft had 254 passengers, most of whom were Israeli. It was directed to Libya before flying to Entebbe Airport in Uganda, where dictator Idi Amin offered the terrorists a safe haven. Some of the hostages were released except 106 Israeli nationals. After negotiations failed, Israel embarked on a daring military intervention that rescued 102 of 106 hostages and killed the seven terrorists. 
one israeli commando was killed while five others were wounded 45 ugandan soldiers manning the airport were killed and 30 aircrafts were destroyed there you have it explorers those were some of the lesser known facts you probably didn't know about uganda for sticking all the way till the end of this video here's an extra bonus fact for you number 11 uganda is known for its birds and gorillas Uganda is a country with diverse wildlife, mainly because of its forest cover and climate. Half of the world's mountain gorillas and 11% of bird species are found in Uganda. Part of the Congo rainforest extends over to Uganda, but unlike the Democratic Republic of Congo, Uganda offers best protection and wildlife, especially to apes. Dear explorers, as always, you can add more facts that you think have not been mentioned in this video in the comment section below, and the best comment will be pinned. Thanks for watching this video. If you want us to cover any of your top 10 topics, please leave your suggestions in the comment section below and your request will be granted. Also, if you did enjoy the video, do well to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe and share with your friends.